We're at Garran Point, just north of Stonehaven, and we're on the very, very northeastern extent of the Highland Boundary Fault, where it goes into the North Sea. So to the left of me, there are Precambrian sediments that make the highlands, the greens and the greys that you can see. To the right of me, there are old red sandstone Devonian sediments, which were deposited in as the Midland Valley was opening up, as the Highland Boundary Fault was active. But the strange thing here is that the fault is forming this quite large promontory out to sea, and in fact defines the edge of the coastline all the way down to Stonehaven. That's unusual because faults, you, know, you get a lot of damage when a fault in the rock, when the fault is moving. Rocks get crushed and fractured, and it should make a very soft fault gauge. So normally faults actually weather away to produce uh, deep in-cut gullies or zones that you get down in Cornwall or in, in Wales that you see. But here it's actually formed this quite hard weathering promontory. And the reason is the damage zone extends quite some way away from the fault plane itself. The fault plane can be very, very narrow, but the fracturing can extend tens or hundreds of meters away from the fault plane. And those fractures then act as uh, conduits for fluids to come up. If those fluids contain minerals, the minerals precipitate out, and it can end up actually bonding the, the fault crush and the damaged rock into a much harder rock than the surrounding country rock. So that's what's happened here.